one of the, there are many barriers to overcome. One of the most critical barriers is the barrier of increasing political participation and political engagement. Fortunately for Latinos, there is an immediate avenue that can be used to be able to increase that participation. And the avenue is focusing upon the next generation, focusing on the millennial generation. Don't get me wrong, I'm not saying we don't need to focus on older adults like myself and encouraging participation there as well, but it's the case that about 94% of all Latinos currently living in the United States who are under the age of 18 are born in the United States. They're already citizens, 94%, almost 100%. 800,000 Latinos turn 18 every year. 800,000. Those are, that is a group that is ideally positioned to be mobilized, to be registered, and to, and to be civically engaged through organizations, through leadership training programs, through colleges and universities, through uh, community-based organizations, any way that is available, that is a group that is going to set a new tone for the future of Latino participation. As those of us who are older leave active political participation, they have an opportunity to take up that space. If we can focus a lot of our current efforts on training that next generation, encouraging that next generation, empowering that next generation, I think we're going to set ourselves up as a country to have a country that has more democratic participation than we've seen in over a hundred years.